Pondi, officially the municipality of Pondi, Tagalog, Bayan ng Pondi, is a second-class municipality in the province of Bulacan, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 89,075 people. The municipality of Pondi lies 41 kilometers 25 miles northeast of Manila and is located at the eastern portion of Bulacan province. With the continuous expansion of Metro Manila, Pondi is now included in the Greater Manila's built-up area which reaches San Ildefonso, Bulacan at its northernmost part. Pondi is one of the youngest towns in Bulacan. During the Spanish regime, Pondi was a part of the political jurisdiction of the town of Maycayan City including the towns of San Jose del Monte, Bacaui, Marilao, Valenzuela, Obando, Santa Maria, Balagtas. It also formed part of the vast Hacienda Santa Maria de Pondi, which included the towns of Sta. Maria and Balagtas and parts of Angad and Bustos. Pondi was then a part of the town Balagtas then Biga until its formal separation and independence on April 17, 1946. History Early history Pondi was originally part of Hacienda of Dominicans named Hacienda which belongs to the town Santa Maria de Pondi now Santa Maria, Bulacan. In 1874 it was turned over to the town of Biga as one of its barrio and the religious activity belongs to Convento de Biga under the auspices of Augustinian order established a chapel under the advocacy of Immaculate Concepcion. The Republic of Cacarong de Sili during the Philippine Revolution, Pondi played a vital and historical role in the fight for Philippine independence. Pondi is historically known for the Real de Cacarong de Sili Shrine, Anang Filipina Shrine, the site where the bloodiest revolution in Bulacan took place, where more than 3,000 Katipunero revolutionaries died. Likewise, it is on this site where the Republic of Real de Cacarong de Sili of 1896, one of the first Philippine revolutionary republics was established. It was in Cacarong de Sili, which about 6,000 Katipuneros from various towns of Bulacan headed by Brigadier General Eusebio Roque, a mysticist, Albolario, better known as Maestrong Cibio or Damabungo. List of Filipino generals in the Philippine Revolution of 1896 and the Filipino-American War of 1899 that the Cacarong Republic was organized shortly after the cry of Pugad Law and referred to as the cry of Balintawak. Andres Bonifacio a Filipino nationalist and revolutionalist who led in the cry of Balintawak. The Kakarong Republic was the first revolutionary government established in Bulacan to overthrow the Spaniards. These significant events have been included as of one of the attributes in the seal of the province of Bulacan. According to available records including the biography of General Gregorio del Pilar entitled, Life and Death of a Boy General, written by Teodoro Cala, former director of the National Library of the Philippines, an improvised fort was constructed at Cacarong de Sili. It had streets, an independent police force, a musical band, a factory of falconets, bolos and repair shops for rifles and cartridges. The Cacarong Republic had a complete set of officials with Canuto Villanueva as Supreme Chief and My Strong Cibio, Eusebio Roque as Brigadier General of the Army. The fort was attacked and totally destroyed on January 1, 1897 by a large Spanish force headed by General Olagar Filiu, Gen. Gregorio del Pilar was only a lieutenant at that time and the Battle of Cacarong de Sili was his first baptism of fire. This was where he was first wounded and escaped to nearby Barangay. Manadal. After the Battle of Cacarong de Sili Mysticist Eusebio Roque were arrested and transferred to Bulacan town where the seat of Alcadia Mayor located and he was sentenced to death. The Cacarong Lodge No. 168 of the Legionarios del Trabajo in memory of the 1,200 Katipuneros who perished in the battle erected a monument of the Anang Filipina Shrine, Mother Philippines Shrine in 1924 in the barrio of Kakarong. The actual site of the Battle of Kakarong de Sili belongs to the administrative and geographical jurisdiction of town of Biga and it was given to Pondi in 1946. The site is now a part of the barangay of Real de Kakarong. 
No less than one of the greatest generals in the Philippines' history, General Emilio Aguinaldo who became first Philippine president visited this sacred ground in the late 50s. The birth of the town of Pondi the independence of Pondi as a new town of Bulacan was through the efforts of Mamerto Carpio Bernardo, the father of Pondi, Bulacan. During his term as mayor of Balagtas, he worked for the independence of Pondi as a town. Pondi got its independence in 1946 from its mother town Balagtas formerly named Biga, under the presidential decree of President Sergio Osmeña the fourth president of the country. Geography Pondi is located at the center of four adjoining towns of Bulacan Province, Santa Maria, Bustos, Angat, and Balagtas. The land area are mostly rice fields devoted for planting crops and agriculture. Some barrios of the town are covered by irrigation system coming from Angat Dam on the Angat River. There are many little rivers that branch out from this river that become estuaries. Some little rivers provide livelihood by fanning gold. The biggest river is Bunsharan River that empties itself to the Philippine Sea. Along the side of the rivers are banana plantations thriving naturally and many taro plants. Pondi is rich in many natural brooks coming from the mainland itself. In some remote areas the lands are still covered by bamboo trees that naturally thrive and multiplies. Some lands privately owned have mango plantations. In some areas that are privately owned are rock deposits being used for housing materials. The eastern area of Poblacion is gifted by the natural panoramic beauty of the scenery of Sierra Madre Mountains in Luzon. Owing to this the morning climate is always cloudy and cool in some areas of the town proper of Pondi, Bulacan. Some of the natural variations in topography of Pondi land areas have been evened out due to the urbanization of the town. The town's central area has been altered substantially by commercial establishments. Climate The prevailing climatic conditions in the municipality is categorized into two types, wet season and dry season. Wet season, rainy season or monsoon season Dry season, summer season Barangays Pondi is subdivided into 22 barangays. Demographics In the 2015 census, the population of Pondi, Bulacan, was 89,075 people, with a density of 2,900 inhabitants per square kilometer or 7,500 inhabitants per square mile. Language and ethnicity Majority of the population of Pandianos are native to Pondi, whose roots can be traced back from the neighboring towns of Balagtas, Bulacan, Bacaui, Bulacan, and Sta. Maria, Bulacan. Some families are intermarriage between immigrants from Ilocos region and as far as Nueva Ecija during earlier periods. The most recent immigrants are from Luzon and Visayas Islands, and Bicol. The population speaks Tagalog and it is the medium of instruction in schools, as well as Kapampangan and English. Religion The majority of the population are Christians. Roman Catholicism is the predominant religion in the municipality and has two parishes, Immaculate Conception Parish in Poblacion Town proper and Sto. Cristo Parish in Barangay. Siling Bada. Other religious groups with strong presence in the municipality are the following, Members Church of God International or Ang Dating Don, Iglesia Ni Cristo, Jehovah's Witness, Jesus is Lord Church, Iglesia Evangelica Metodista en las Islas Filipinas and other evangelical or born again groups, as well as Pentecostals. Islam is also practiced with the presence of Abu Bakr Mosque as the first mosque established in the town of Pondi, located at Barangay Masuso. Local government Mayor, Celestino T. Marquez, KBL Vice Mayor, Adi. Noel Roxas, KBL Municipal Councilors Gavino Austria, KBL. Vic Concepcion, LP. Henry Marquez, KBL. 
Dr. May Ann Sebastian, LP. Wilma Perulin, LP. Florin Romero, LP. Vicente Gadas, KBL. Rolando Cruz, KBL. Ex officio members. Ariel Colonzo, ABC president. Former mayors. Mariano Bernardo Cabeza during Spanish regime. Catalino Bernardo Cabeza during Spanish regime. Cornelio Reyes Cabeza during Spanish regime. Matias Salvador, first mayor after the town gained independence, 1946 from Balagtas, Bulacan. Manuel Guisano Santos, senior former mayor of Balagtas, Bulacan. Addy. Jose Espina Bernardo. Mamerto Carpio Bernardo, former mayor of Balagtas, Bulacan. The father of Pondi, Bulacan. Addy. Ruben Roque. Dr. Valeriano Domingo D.M.D. Addy. Venustiano Serenas Roxas Sr. Arturo Andres Leonardo Cruz Andres Anastasia Hilario, appointed mayor, OIC Oliver Marcelo Andres Roberto Magsaysay OCA Jr. Enrico A. Roque Economy Major industries, furniture making, garments and embroidery, metalcraft, poultry and hog raising, agriculture and farming. Local food processing. Commercial retail dry goods business. Recreation facilities for tourism. Major products, local processed food and rice. Furnitures. Embroidered clothes, bed linens and kitchen linens. Minor products, orchid plants for retail. Mangoes for local consumption and other minor agricultural products sold in the local market as well as the markets of the next towns. Poultry products like table eggs and chicken meat. Duck raising and salted egg production. Little fish ponds for raising tilapia fish. This provides the town folks their livelihood. Banks The town of Pondi has two banks. Rural Bank of Pondi Incorporated, which currently has two branches, one in Pondi and another in Sta. Maria, Bulacan next town to Pondi in the northeast. The third branch of the Rural Bank of Pondi will soon open in Giginto, Bulacan, 2012, which is northwest of Pondi, next to its mother town Balagtas, Bulacan. Rural Bank of Pondi is the pioneer bank of the town founded by Julita Cruz Andres, a resident of Pondi who is a native of Angat, Bulacan, Barangay. Niugan. An Adi. Suriaco C. Santos, a native of Pondi. The banks primarily serve agricultural businesses and farmers and animal husbandry businesses. Gateway Rural Bank Incorporated, Gatebank, a chain of banks in Bulacan Province and Luzon Island. The banks provide international money transfer. They primarily serve agricultural businesses and farmers, and animal husbandry businesses. The bank was founded 1997 by a native of Pondi, Bulacan, Mercedes G. Santos Coloma, 2012 president. The parents of Mercedes are Addy. Suriaco C. Santos and Belen Bernardo Galvez Santos. Attractions Real de Cacarong de Sili, the site of revolutionary battle during Spanish regime. It is located in Barangay of Cacarong. Where a monumental shrine is erected called Anang Filipina Shrine, Mother Philippines Shrine. Rizal Park, the mini park is in Poblacion area that serves as recreation park where some town programs are held. The park has big monument of the Philippine national hero, Dr. Jose P. Rizal Jose P. Rizal. It is a close replica of Rizal Monument in Luneta. The mini park was built during the term of Adi. Jose Espina Bernardo, the third mayor of the town. Pondi Mineral Spring Resort, the oldest amusement park located in the Poblacion area, which as of 2012 is closed. 
It was named owing to the nature of soft water that comes from a water well that supplied the whole central area of the town, Mineral Spring, the water well primarily supplied the central Poblacion area. It was famous during earlier times and neighboring towns come to get water for drinking purpose in Pondi. Mineral Spring was built during the term of the third mayor of the new town, Adi. Jose Espina Bernardo, there was an area used for washing clothes by the town folks. The water well as of 2012 no longer supplies water in the area, owing to the depth of the well which must have reached its saturation level. Dr. Totoy Resort, a mini resort built in the backyard of the residence of Dr. Totoy, Dr. Valeriano Crisostomo DMD residential lot. The mini resort is suitable for more private family vacationers and little groups. It is situated in Barangay. Bunsharan 1. Manadal Fresh Water Resort, a mini resort situated in Barangay. Manadal. Villa Manawig Nature Resort and Retreat House, a retreat house situated in Poblacion area of the town in Amparo subdivision. It has a little chapel and station of the cross life-size images. Villa Conception Wet and Wild Waves, Inc., an amusement park situated in Barangay of Masuso. Amana Water Park Resort, an amusement park situated in Barangay of Bagong Barrio. It is almost a 10-hectare park with lodging facilities and food chain stores. It is the largest water wave park in the Philippines. Sitio Antonio, a new amusement resort with large visual attractions and giant slides with amenities perfectly fit for team building activities. Also situated in Barangay Bagong Barrio and was named after the family name. Antonio. A business-minded family whom resides also at Bagong Barrio. Society and culture Sports and senior center The town of Pondi in the central Poblacion area along Manuel G. Santos Sr. Street has a sports complex ground, Pondi Sports Complex. The site is a semi-playground for children and equipped with some facilities for sports. It has a basketball court. The sports complex houses a center for senior town folks where they do senior activities and meetings, election of yearly officials as well. And the various members that also assist in some outreach domestic programs in the town, senior citizen center. Within the compound is a water well that supplies the Poblacion area of water until the northmost area of the town managed by NAWASA, National Water and Sewerage Authority, Water Supply and Sanitation in the Philippines. Pondi Sports Complex aka Leonardo Andre Sports Complex Senior Citizen Center Office of Senior Citizen, located at Masagana was the first senior citizen office built not in town proper. It serves as the center of senior citizen for the residents of Masagana. St. Imedias Sports Complex, newly built covered court located also at Masagana, near at the St. Imedias Chapel. First of it owns, in Pondi, as this complex was equipped with proper sports equipment and also the court's measurements was based on the standard sized and measure of a basketball, volleyball court. This was also the center for every celebration and any festivities of the barangay. The elegant chapel and fully equipped sports complex was built and sponsored by an influential family living in the barangay. Town festivities The town celebrates every year before Christmas vacation lantern parade that goes around the Poblacion area. It is sponsored by Mamerto C. Bernardo Memorial Central Public School wherein all students of the elementary school have their lantern designs. There is a lantern design competition and awarding of prizes to the students. The town fiesta of Pondi is celebrated every first week of December for its town patroness. Our Lady of Immaculate Conception. The town feast day is called Fiesta ng Pondi. The town celebrates it with band of musicians for two days usually Saturday and Sunday. The band goes around the central Poblacion area. Along the streets are hanging. Banderitas. Little multicolored flags lined in long ropes, a cultural heritage influenced by Spanish culture, Spain that colonized the country during the 15th century. During earlier periods the occasion was very festive with visitors of various families from different towns and regions. 
It is celebrated like a Thanksgiving Day of the town. Infrastructure Transportation facilities Ponte Town proper is serviced by for hire tricycle, motorcycle with sidecar, that can go as far as Baliwag, Bulacan in a shortcut route through Barangay Road, as well as the route going to Sta. Maria, Bulacan and Bacaui, Bulacan. Some regular options are the official jeepney schedule of Sta. Maria, Bulacan route to Angat, Bulacan which passes by Pondi since the town is centrally situated in between these two towns. There is a jeepney route from Pondi to Balagtas, Bulacan where there are several commercial buses that passes by Bacaui, Bulacan exiting in Barangay. Tall. To the super highway, formerly named North Diversion, North Luzon Expressway facilitating a short travel to Manila and other Metro Manila areas. There are several commercial buses as well in Central Poblacion of Sta. Maria, Bulacan passing through the super highway. Medical facilities and hospital Pondi being the youngest town and smallest town do not have a government public hospital but mini health center that provides outreach medical services and midwifery services. As of 2012 a government hospital is being constructed in Barangay. Bunsharan. There are several private practitioners of family health care in the town and some barrios. For more extensive health care programs the town folks are accommodated in the capital city of Malolos where Bulacan Medical Center formerly Provincial Hospital located. Education Public schools Mamerto C. Bernardo Memorial Central School, a public school in the town proper named after Mamerto Carpio Bernardo. The school has satellite branches in all barrios of the town providing elementary education in the whole town of Pondi. The main central school is situated in the town proper providing education to the masses in the Poblacion Central area. The school is situated along Jose E. Bernardo Street, a major street named after another mayor Adi. Jose Espina Bernardo. Addy. Jose Espina Bernardo is a cousin to Mamerto Carpio Bernardo. He built the roads of the new town and central water supply. It was during his term that the new town reached its height of community development. He also built the Rizal Plaza as a tribute to the Philippine national hero Dr. Jose Rizal. Ponciano Bernardo past mayor of Quezon City is their cousin. Ponciano A. Bernardo's father migrated to Nueva Ecija with his cousin Francisco Bernardo Oliveros, whose sisters and cousins were left behind in Pondi, Bulacan. Virginia Ramirez Cruz Memorial School, Siling Bata National High School, a secondary branch of Mamerto Carpio Bernardo Memorial School in Barrio. Siling Bata. Providing secondary education, Bureau of Secondary Education, in different barrios and barangays adjacent to. Siling Bata. The school was named Virginia R. Cruz Memorial School after Virginia Bernardo Ramirez Cruz, who donated the land where the public high school was erected and established. She was a past president of Philippine Charity Sweepstakes Office PCSO, Philippine Lottery Draw. Her mother is Valentina Bernardo of Pondi, Bulacan who married Ponciano Ramirez of Bacaui, Bulacan. Virginia was born in Bacaui, Bulacan. Her husband is past congressman of Bulacan, Adi. Erasmo Ramirez Cruz. Adi, Matias Bernardo Ramirez is her brother, a past mayor of Bacaui, Bulacan. Buncheron National High School, a public high school in Barrio. Buncheron. First providing secondary education to nearby barangays. The whole town has three public high schools that includes Masagana High School and public elementary schools in every barangay, barrio of the municipality. Masagana National High School, a public secondary school in barrio. Masagana. High School Annex of Buncheron National High School. Holy Angels. College of Bulacan Inc., formerly Holy Angels. Academy, founded in 1951. Immaculate Conception Child Development Center Inc. ICCDC and College of Mary Immaculate. Founded in 1981. Manuel Guisano Santos Sr. Memorial School. Founded in 1990. 
Gentle Shepherd Montessori. Founded in 1999. Christian Academy of Pondi Montessori Academy of Malibu Colleges College of Mary Immaculate Knox Internationale Technological Institute Inc. Bulacan Polytechnic College, Pondi Campus Pondi Technological Institute Gallery Notes References Halili, Maria Christine N. 2004. Philippine History. Manila, Rex Book Store. ISBN 978-971-23-3934-9 External links Philippine Standard Geographic Code all about Pondi Bulacan Philippine Census Information